And we are back. This is The Flash, Season 6, Episode 8, Part 2 of the mid-season finale. I'm honestly not ready, because last week was not only my favorite of the season, but it was one of my favorites the entire show. It was just so fucking good in the, the last five minutes in the ending. Holy shit. So I'm so excited to see how the whole blood work arc ends. I want to see him go full blood form. If I, It's what I deserve, to see him go full blood work form. Okay, and since it's the mid-season finale, we're definitely ending on a cliffhanger, although not the- Of course, this, Arrow, are definitely going to end on the crisis- the same crisis teaser that Batman 1 and Supergirl got. But the Flash itself is going to- I feel like it's going to end on a cliffhanger that sets up the second half of the season? Maybe. I don't know. Oh, God. I don't know, I just have a really bad feeling. <laughs> I don't know, it could just be me, but we'll see what happens. Oh my god. Hi, could you go full bloody form, please? I want to see. Oh, Barry. That's creepy. Oh, son of a bitch! What if Barry is still alive in there? He is, but trap. he's not here right now. We don't even have comms, it's too risky. Listen, I just need to look him in his eyes. If the emitter okay, yes, the Barry is still in there, but this isn't Barry right now. This is a trick. If you go out there and that's not Barry, you could get infected or worse. I don't see Cisco's right. Barry is still in there, but right now it's not Barry. I know you can hear me. And you can hear when I tell you. I love you. And after everything that we've been through together. I know that this is not how our story ends. Hell no. Come home to me. Come on, Barry, come back. It's not gonna be that easy, but you know. No. 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 In good time. This is not over. And yeah, we still got Trust me, 45 minutes. Whoa! Killer Frost! Just still. What, is he good? Oh, you just stay down. Holy shit! Get the hell away from me. Oh, Allegra. Trust. It's Captain Lester, okay? No, we must get the hell out of here. He better be okay. Go, go, run, 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 run. Oh shit. Uh, uh, there you go. Just keep running. Oh, fuck, the door's stuck. Oh, they got it. Come on, Cisco. Is it working? It looks like it's working. It's working! Oh, of course. Oh, well, destroy it. And we don't have time to fix it either. No! He wants to blow it up. Oh my god. Hey, don't you call Barry? Is he listening? I'm coming home! Come back, Barry. 
Perry said those words. Yeah, he's still in there. Perry said those exact words to me when he made me team leader. Which means he's still in there. Perhaps he could have infected me. He could have killed me. But he didn't. Instead, he just did a complete 180 for no reason. Because Barry took control, partially? There's something else. Ramsey said I'm coming home. I begged Barry to come home the last time I saw him, but I didn't think that I was getting through. Iris, what if that was Barry? What if you were right, and he's still alive inside Dark Flash? Then he could be trying to tell us what to do. I gotta take down blood work. Yes. I think I just figured out Barry's plan. Let the light in. He just told us the next step. We need to lower the defenses. Let them in. Okay. Come back, Barry. Yes, come back. Fight it. What are you doing? Kill No. Come back, Barry. Come back. Oh, fuck. Not anymore. Oh, shit. No, Barry. Oh, yes, Iris. Oh, fuck. Please stay down. He's not gonna stay down. But... No. Hurry. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Please work, please work, please work. Oh, please say it worked. Yes, yes. It worked! Thank God! So Barry's back? What about Ramsey? Is he cured now or is he still bloody? What? He's still. Wait. Wait, hold on. Oh, thank God. I thought he was still bloody for a minute. Yeah, your Barry's back. Hey, uh. Scary guy who tried to kill us all. Oh fuck, Ramsey's gone. Shit. He won't get far. We'll kick his ass, Barry. You're not the hero here. I am. Okay. Full blood form. Full blood form. Oh, 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 oh. Oh my god. Holy shit. That looks like a skeleton for a head. That's gross, but cool. Yes, Barry! Okay, but that looks so cool, though. Fuck you! Okay, oh, stop. I felt the same way. My beautiful boy. What the? His mother? How is she? Okay, but now I kind of feel bad. Like, he, he genuinely just wanted to help people, but he went insane. Trying to cure death. Oh. No, it's kind of tonight. Oh, God. Don't remind me. Or worse, I am going to be there with you. I'll be right there with you to the very end, okay? Stop, I'm going to cry. Because the only thing more inevitable than crisis is your love. Is us. Is right. Whatever's in store for us, it can't change what we mean to each other. It can't <sighs> us what's in our hearts. Fuck. Oh, oh god, I'm scared. Red skies. Crisis is here. 
I swear to God, the anti monitor just walks through those doors, I swear to God. Oh. Fuck. Shit. <laughs> Crisis is here. Shit, I'm fucking scared. Oh god, so this was an amazing mid-season finale. Oh my god. I have to say the blood work arc did not end how I expected. I thought he was gonna die somehow. But no. Nope. The whole the whole trick with his mother, I didn't see that coming. That was a good twist. Um that moment with him and his mother where he reverted back to full Ramsey. He's on he was honestly he wasn't Bloodwork wasn't my favorite villain, but compared to Cicada and DeVoe. He's miles better. Like, DeVoe was boring. Cicada was just garbage. Like, he's definitely nowhere near Reverse Flash or Zoom level, that's for sure. But he was honestly not that bad. Like, this this episode and last week's episode, he was genuinely fucking scary. And his motives were fleshed out pretty good. He was sympathetic for me. Like, he was a pretty good villain. Like, not my best, not the favorite. But he was good. And... I finally got to see full Bloodwork form, and it was gross, but really cool. Thank God I got to see that. That was so awesome. <laughs> oh God, and that the final ending scene before Crisis came, when they were all like reminiscing back in the old days. God, it's like wait till Crisis to make me emotional. Wait, no, I that's a contradiction. That's contradicted now because Crisis is here. So let the emotions come. Fuck. <sighs> yeah, I'm fucking scared because I do think Barry is going to die in crisis, but it's temporary. Like, yeah, they've been hyping it up. He will die. It's just not going to be permanent because there's no Flash without the Flash. So, <sighs> but it's still going to be like, great it. Here I am. I know he's going to die, but I know it's temporary, but I'm still going to bawl my eyes out. It's like I know it's coming, but I'm still going to get sad. <sighs> oh, God. Oh, we're only one week away. Or no, we're less than a week. It starts on Sunday, and I'm already freaking out. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I'm scared to see the anti-monitor. I, I thought he was going to show up at the end of tonight. Thank God he didn't, because, like, give me a week to prepare for that, okay? As for 6B, I'm curious to see who the second big bad will be now that Bloodberg is, the Bloodberg is done. I don't know who it'll be. It's supposed to be the most personal villain the team has ever faced. At first I thought that was Bloodberg, but no. Bloodberg wasn't really personal. Like, a little personal, I guess, but compared to, like, Thawne, nowhere near personal. I think the second big bad is supposed to be as personal as Thawne, if not more personal. Like, because Thawne was personal because he killed his mother and started the whole thing. Zoom killed his father. Savitar... Savitar was very, so that was personal too. So... It's either someone they know, like, it could be... Like, imagine if it's Red Death or something, but instead of it being Barry and Bruce, it's someone we know, like... R like, Eddie? Ronnie? Henry? Not Henry, but I could see it being Ronnie or Eddie. But no, I feel like Red Death is being saved for next season as the big bad, because that would be so cool. As for who the second big bad is, I have no fucking clue, we'll find out next year. Well, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. That was The Flash, season 6, episode 8, the mid-season finale. Overall, I love this episode. Both parts of the mid-season finale were amazing. This season is honestly amazing so far. Like, it's way better than both season 5 and 4. It's just, yeah, it's been depressing because of Crisis, but it's been really good and Bloodwork was really good. So, if Season 6B is as good as the first half, then it'll be a really good season for me compared to 5 and 4. So, I'm curious to see what happens, but until then, let's just deal with Crisis next week, okay? We'll cry together and get through the heartbreak. But anyway, that is it for now. Be sure to let me know what you thought of this mid-season finale and what you think will happen in Crisis next week. And I will see you guys next time.